Okay, here I am today about to do an open box review of the Bluetooth JBL 120 earplugs or earbuds as they call them. Uh, I'm just going to say this real quick. I'm not being paid by Apple or JBL or uh, Samsung. I'm using this on my camera phone. So, just want to get that out of the way. Let's just jump right into it. Uh, I bought these about a month ago off of Amazon for about $59.99. And um, overall, I've been happy with them. Uh, the sound is quality, has good quality sound. Uh, crisp and clean and clear. This is the case. As you can see, there is the JBL. And on the front, right here on the front, there you can't see it because I'm in the shadow here in the sun. There's three little lights when you're when you have them charging, they do come on. Of course, it's easy to flip open. You got the the slots where they go in, nice and tight and tucked. The case itself, it's heavy, little heavy, sturdy. It's good. Got a good matte finish. There is the plug, the USB port. Charge and like I said, it's got a nice matte finish, solid. It's a little flimsy, but you know what do you expect when you pay $59.99 for these? Uh, you know, they're, they're, not, they're getting quality, but, you know, but still, anyway, it's a nice case. They give you some ear, extra earbuds, as you can see, the directions in the box, everything was nicely tucked away in here. Uh, earbuds themselves. Uh, haven't quite had to figure out how to use them yet as far as the right earbud it clicks you can click it but it doesn't do anything the left earbud ah <laughs> it uh, rewinds reverses if you're playing a song it goes back but it doesn't go forward now one of the things I have an issue with is I have my iPod that I use it's where all my music is at and um the connection between the two is not always great. Uh, I have to do it sometimes several times when I take the earbuds out. You hear this little noise in your ear it makes. It's got a little, little light over here at the end of the, you can't really see it. Right there at the tip of my finger. It's got a little blue light that comes on. Uh, when I'm connecting the two, I haven't had them on for a while. Uh, or I haven't been listening to them for a while. The connection is not always just automatic. And I can say the same thing about my cell phone when I use it on my cell phone. Uh, it takes a little while to, to, not a little while, it just takes several attempts to, to connect. Which is really, to me, is no big deal. You know, I'm not a technical guy. I don't need, you know, uh, I've watched some other videos on some of the people that did reviews on this particular brand. Uh, you know, they're, they're more technical into the, you know, into the cell phone and stuff where I just like to listen to music. You know, I'm doing this just to, for the for the consumer you to see you know you might be looking for some earbuds and you might come across my video and say okay we're gonna listen to this guy what he has to say i'm not real technical i don't we've got all that technical lingo so we just we're just running the mill here we go let's do it let's do it the earbuds again uh they're a little lumpy i think they're a little clumpy i have a hard time putting them in my ear sometimes not a hard time putting my ear sometimes i have to jam them in my ear the sound, like I said, the quality of the sound is really good. Uh, I listen to them at night. Uh, I usually charge them. I usually charge about uh, overnight, and I think the playback is uh, oh, it's like 16. I don't know how many hours. It's probably about eight hours worth, of, or four hours worth of, or I think it's like four hours of uh, playback. And that's nice. You know, I listen to, to a lot of jazz and rock and, and blues and stuff like that. So the sound is really crisp. I know that, that I will say. It is sharp. I think I said that earlier. It's just a sharp, clean sound. Um, it, it's not your $120, $130, $140, $50 earbuds like Bose or Beats or Sony or one of those other heavy hitter brands. But, you know, for $59.99... You know, they serve the purpose, they do good, they, they work, the music is crisp. I don't have to really turn my volume up too much on my cell, on my iPod because it's just, it just pops at you, it comes at you. 
And I've been pretty happy with that, you know, as, as far as that is concerned. Um, and they are good, you know. Like I said, they are good, you know, for the price. You can't beat it, you know. They're, they, they're, they seem like they're really well-built, durable. Like I said, sometimes I have to kind of jam them up in my ear or, you know, just so I can get that, you know, because it's just so bulky for earbuds. I've had smaller earbuds than this. Um, that's pretty much it. Um, I'm going to say, I'm going to rate these probably like a, for the music part of it, the music, the sound, probably give about a four and a half. As far as the connections from my iPod to the cell phone, and I did say, I hope I did mention that in my cell phone, when you call, uh, the sound is really good when you're talking on your phone, on your cell phone. I hope I did mention that. Um, I'll give it about a four. Four stars, and uh, like I said, I've been happy with them. You know, it's, it's not the best, but they're definitely they're there. They definitely work. And I'm gonna wrap it up. I've got some other videos that uh, I've done some uh, product review for another uh, earbud company, uh, and I've done some other videos, walking tour and the, the driving tour here in Houston. So go check out my other videos if you don't mind. I appreciate it. Any comments, feel free. And uh, please subscribe. And uh, like I said, go check out my videos and my other videos. And uh, we'll, we'll talk later. Have a good day.